Welcome to my channel, The Sake of Physics. In today's video, I'm going to solve a problem which is related with the torque. Uh, so here, F is given and it passes through a point whose position vector is minus J plus K. So in first part of the question, I need to find the moment of F about the origin. And in the second um, part of the question, the moment of F about the point of which the position vector is I plus K. So for the first part of the question, I need to find torque, which is equal to R cross F. So whenever um, there is a cross product between two vectors and vectors are given in the rectangular components, uh, then we can write down R cross F equals R Y F C minus R C F Y with the I component, a uh, unit vector plus R Z F X minus R X F Z with the J unit vector plus R X and F Y minus R Y F X with the K unit vector. So here R and F are given in the uh, rectangular component. So I can plug those values in. So R Y is minus one. And FZ is zero because there is no component with K unit vector here. And RZ is one. And FY is minus two. So I unit vector plus RZ is one. And FX is one, two minus Rx is 0 and Fz is 0 with J unit vector plus Rx is 0 Fy is minus 2 minus Ry is minus 1 and Fx is 1 with K unit vector so here I will left with this will become 0 and this will become 2i and here this term is 0 so plus a j only and this term will be 0 and this will make it plus k so this is the answer for the first part of the question when we need to find the moment of force along the about the origin but for the second part, we already have one unit vector. Uh, let me uh, give them names. So for example, I say this is R1. R1 is I plus K. And R2 is, let's say, minus J plus K. Then R2 minus R1 will be minus j plus k and this negative will make uh, r1 minus i minus k so this will be cancel out and i will be left with minus i minus j so here i have this expression the cross product in terms of the rectangular components so here r2 minus r1 will act like R. So I have R minus I minus J and F is already given I minus 2J. So what I need to do is just plug those values in. So here if I say this is equation A. So A plug values in A. I will have um, 
So R Y is minus one and F Z is zero minus R Z is zero and F Y is minus two. So this is I unit vector plus R Z is zero and F X is one minus R X is minus one and F Z is zero. This is J unit vector plus R X is minus one and F Y is minus two minus R Y is minus one and F X is a one K unit vector. So here you can see that this zero and this zero will make the whole term zero. So there is no nothing with the i unit vector. Similarly, nothing with the j unit vector. So here this negative one and this negative two will make it positive two and a plus one k. Okay. And I can write down 3k. So this is the answer for the second part of the question. Thank you so much.